Dean with I Buy Cool Stuff. So I got a call on some cool stuff up near my property from a business card I'd handed out uh, during the summer. So take a look at this buy here. So anyhow, the uh, gentleman's 82 years old and I had seen him at a garage sale. Hand him, handed him my card and let's go over. There's a lot of stuff here to go over. So I bought uh, two Swedish Mausers. This one here is obviously a sniper. Um, and all the serial numbers on this one, except for the receiver number there, are zeros. Never seen that before. I don't know a lot about Swedish snipers, but I had to buy it. This is another Swedish Mauser. And the Swedish Mausers have discs on them with information on their accuracy and stuff. The third one is a very similar Mauser. It is a Chilean Mauser. Very pretty crust on there. And I believe that's in 7mm Mauser. Got a very pretty crust down here on the stock. So he had probably close to 100 guns to pick from. He looked all the prices up. He knew pretty well what he was looking for. Um, this is a 3040 Crag stock. He knew that. And But it's a carbine stock in really good shape. And that I will probably make the most profit on. I get 50 on the stock. There's a number of bayonets. This is an M1 Grand. This is a that's a PAL, which is always a good maker. World War II M1 carbine. That's an Imperial. This is a World War II German Luftwaffe boot knife. Let's see if we can. Right there, you can see the little Luftwaffe symbol. So, this is another M1 Garand knife, a bayonet, I'm sorry. And this one is Union Fork and Hoe, I believe, but it's got brown grips. If you can see that, the difference in the grips, these ones are brown, these ones are black. The brown's a little more desirable. So this is your last uh, M1 Garand bayonet. Probably one of the most interesting things is this scope. It is a Marlin number no. 1 scope in the box. It's a brass tube. I know nothing about this stuff. This stuff is fresh, 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 fresh. I just uh, picked it up within the hour. And we're just taking a quick video. So this is a 98K bayonet with uh, matching scabbard. Dated uh, 1940. This is an Africa Core frog that it's in. Very tough frog to find. Very, very tough. So what a combination to get. It's obviously a vet bring back. And it, all this stuff needs to be cleaned up. This is a mismatched 98K bayonet. I think this is, is it Italian or is it Spanish? But anyhow, very, very cool stuff. Lots of cool stuff. And you got to buy cool stuff. So... Up here at the property and uh, made a great buy because I work hard at it, because I give out the business cards, because I've got it written on my truck. In fact, he seen my truck at a garage sale and uh, he asked me about uh, buying this stuff. So, and it was all summer and it's, we're in February right now. So, anyhow, do me a favor, like, subscribe, comment, helps with the algorithm uh get out there and find some stuff what a beautiful day it's cold as heck but it's nice out the sun is fantastic and like i always say god bless you and god bless america